Um, I'm a migraine patient and I've been suffering from migraines probably since I was about 20. Uh, my mother has migraines and uh, I have done everything possible to get rid of these migraines. I usually get them probably three, four times a month. I've been to chiropractors, I've been to the Diamond Headache Clinic, I've taken medicine, I've been on preventative medicine, I've done anything and everything, diets, a nutritionist, um, anything you could possibly imagine I did. And then finally I had a friend who told me that I should probably go to a dentist who specializes in TMJ. Well at that point I was like, I was done. I mean I'd spent $3,000 on a chiropractor, I'd gone to the Diamond Headache Clinic, I've done every type of drug you could possibly imagine, I've tried to, you know, do the headache diaries, eliminate caffeine, eliminate chocolate. So I was like, all right, whatever, I'll go. You know, what last resort. And as it turns out, it was what has um, changed my life. <laughs> uh, he created a uh, mouthpiece for me. I was grinding my teeth at night, and it was causing a lot of my migraines. I thought they were crazy. Well, how could a dentist fix your headaches? I mean, why, why would you believe it? I mean, I was going to the Diamond Headache Clinic. They specialize in headaches, in migraine headaches. So why would a dentist, you know? And I'm actually one of the people, too, that I, I've tried all the natural stuff, you know, eliminating food, doing, uh, taking preservatives, t drinking teas. I mean, you name it, I've tried it. I've done all the internet research. So, yeah, I mean, there is some stuff out there about dentists, but I just didn't believe that that could possibly be the problem. And now that I know that I grind my teeth, I can feel it. I actually did wear my mouthpiece last night, and I can tell that my jaw is tight. Yeah, he took a full jaw x-ray. He did some, I had to open my mouth, close my mouth. He um, did, stuck his fingers in there, did, I think, 30, 40 different things inside my mouth. I don't know, I don't, don't really remember, but, uh, he definitely did a full diagnostic TMJ appointment and then he said that we needed to create this mouthpiece. It's uh, specially made to your mouth, obviously they do molds and then they send it out to a lab and then you have to wear it. To get used to it I started wearing it for like an hour or two when I was watching TV. I did that for about a week and then I felt like I could keep it in longer and now I sleep with it at night. although. Sometimes I forget, and when I forget, it's my own fault, and then you wake up and your mouth is tight and it hurt, you know. He, they are the nicest people. Gloria is great. This is nurse. She makes you feel like you're at home, you know. She lets you use, I had to use some, um, oh, what are those things called? The, uh, the electrodes that you put on your face, and, you know, they let you, you know, use that for a month. And I told her it was working. So she's like, well, just use it for another month. And then she's like, oh. and then I would bring it back and she'd be like, well, do you still need it? I'd be like, yeah. She's like, okay, just use it for another month, you know? So they're very um, agreeable and helpful. And then Dr. Moses is very good. He's got a great, uh, well, I was gonna say bedside manner, but he's not, I mean, it wasn't exactly in the hospital room, but you know, he's got, he's a great doctor. He explains everything thoroughly. Obviously, I didn't retain half the information that he told me, <laughs> but, you know, as long as it's working, I mean, and he knows all the scientific stuff behind it, what do I care, you know? I mean, I, before I came to see Dr. Moses, uh, last March, I had five days that I didn't have a headache, and that's when I finally cracked and went to see him, because I just, I didn't know what to do anymore. Well, not to bash a certain entity that I went to for a very long time who specializes in headaches. Um, I think that they just tell you that there's something wrong and that there's, it's medically, you know, you need drugs and they push the drugs. And so you start believing that because you just want the pain to go away. I mean, I was self-medicating myself. I was doing my Relpax, Excedrin migraine, I was taking Motrin, I mean anything, anything to get rid of this stuff. And I used to joke I with my so many drugs in my system and I just wanted to stop. And now that I have a natural way of getting rid of the migraines, I mean it's it's a it's great. You know? I mean I'm a huge proponent of it. I, I tell everybody, I mean I have people at work that they have migraines. I'm like, you gotta go see Dr. Moses. And they you know they don't believe you either. It's it, that is the number one problem that he probably has facing him, is that how can a dentist help you?
and you know, I've been in several car accidents. I've had some head trauma. I, when I was playing beach volleyball one day, my friend spiked my head and I hit the pole. I mean, so I've had some head trauma too, and my jaw is a little off, and so it's definitely something to look into as far as from a natural standpoint of fixing migraines. Because I'm also not a big believer in drugs. I think anybody who has migraine headaches should give it a try. I mean, they, they'll probably One find thing that I did sure. find. Uh, I have Blue Cross Blue Shield insurance, and I actually got them to cover the mouthpiece and the doctor visit by doing a full search within a 50 mile radius if there's not a dentist or a doctor that can treat it, which there isn't in the Chicago area. And then I put my case before them. I mean, you have to fill out tons of paperwork. It's worth it though, because I got, I think, almost 90% of the, of the whole process covered. So out of pocket, I mean, it can be expensive out of pocket if you don't have insurance, but, which is another deterrent that people probably don't want to deal with. But they do have finance plans and they're more than willing to work with you. They, I mean, Dr. Moses wants to help you. So anything that he can do to help you, and help you pay for it, I think he would do and he would work with you in the process.